third story, we call it Davos going to Hollywood. This is the Milken uh, conference, which is a big deal every year. But this year, it seems particularly the people that are going out there. You know, Stephen Mnuchin, the Treasury Secretary, Tom Brady, the, the quarterback, <laughs> of, you know. And his wife. David Solomon, who's coming in to run Goldman Sachs. Steve Ballmer. I mean, it's an extraordinary group of people they've got coming together. Why? Right, it'd be easier to come on here and talk about who's not going. Um, I think it's just one of these events that's grown and grown and grown, and now it's it's become the conference to go to. If you want to talk about it, it's sort of cooler than Davos. It's like Davos, but with the chic and without the snow, crucially. Well, but I, so what do people actually get done? Is it just basically a, a time for people to go and sort of wax philosophical about their uh, sort of agenda of the day? Or what? Just, are there actually deals getting done? Yeah, I think so. You split it into two things. Obviously, there is a lot of waxing philosophical that a lot of people are sort of grandstanding, but you also have a lot of behind the scenes stuff happening. So, there was, I think, in the story we wrote this morning, you can attend these private meetings with Jorge Lehman, who's one of the founders of 3G. Now, anyone who's in the investment world, that's money worth paying. If you can sit down with him and hear his ideas, maybe what he's going to next buy, what, you know, Kraft Hein goes after, that's hugely important. So, you see a lot of those, you know, behind the scenes or off stage meetings, and I suppose that's the real value add to people. And if you had any doubts about redemption in the United yes. States, Michael Milken <laughs> has to be exhibit number one, right? I mean, if you remember, this man amazing. went to prison for manipulating financial markets, and yet he's really reformed and really did, redone himself. He's a very substantive person, as you know, and he's brought together a lot of substantive people, and they have substantive discussions. It's extraordinary. So what are you saying? The Xerox board shouldn't be that worried, even if they... <laughs> yeah, exactly. They can come back and... <laughs> Look at this bounce back. back. Yeah, exactly. exactly. <laughs> the Xerox conference next time. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm always surprised leaders. when we're talking about Xerox. Does anybody Xerox anything anymore? Does that even exist? It is funny to think it used to be a verb. <laughs> <laughs>